Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope all of you are doing great. In this video today, I am going to show you my favorite sari from the Maheshwari silk collection that I have relaunched on the website. The silver jewelry that I wear with most of my Indian outfits and some new body care, hair care, skin care and makeup products that I have recently bought and I am enjoying using those products. By no means am I an expert but I have found what works for me by learning from my experiences and sometimes really bad fashion choices. But let's start this video by watering my plants and pruning them. Starting with the sari, this is a Maheshwari silk block printed sari that I have curated from a small weaving town of Maheshwar in Madhya Pradesh. Now this is an extremely lightweight sari that is perfect for summers and drapes so effortlessly. If you are not experienced in draping a sari, I feel this can be such a key piece in your wardrobe. The fabric is very soft and stays at its place. I love the block print detail on it and I personally like to wear my saris with non-conventional blouses. Quite often, I pair my saris with crop tops and blazers. This one I'm wearing with an old Zara peplum blouse which I feel adds a modern touch to this look. The sari comes with a spun and woven label and here's a close-up look of the pallu. And for the jewellery, it's very lightweight oxidized silver which I feel adds up the perfect ethnic look. Coming to the products I bought, First up is this almond shar oil from L'Occitane. This is my second bottle of shar oil from this French brand. It's a decadent oil that transforms into a luxurious milky lather upon touching water. The smell of infused oils is so lovely and it leaves my skin so soft and smooth. On the right hand side is the shar oil I used earlier that had shea butter in it. And the new one comes with sweet almond oil in it. I also got two samples of after shower body oil. Before I buy any new product, I like to try out few samples just to see how my skin reacts to it. Next up is this Dior Forever Cushion Powder. Now this has turned out to be a surprise. This is my second tub in the shade light. Earlier I bought the shade medium which was a bit darker for my skin tone. I absolutely love this product. This does not leave any dry patches and gives a smooth matte finish to my skin. I also got two samples from Dior, Jador and Joy perfume samples. Next up is this beautiful pearl bracelet from a Korean jewelry store that has some really pretty and dainty pieces which I feel would be perfect to build a stack. Lastly there are these eye patches from Patchology and hair serum and supplements from the new Co. I read some very good reviews of all these products and thought of giving them a try. The Patchology eye masks come with caffeine in it which is good for puffy eyes. I always prefer keeping the eye patches in the fridge and whenever I have to use them I take out two eye patches and it gives a really refreshing feel to my eyes. Uh, these Nuco products are extremely popular and they have been out of stock for a very long time. This is in months that I found them to be restocked and I just placed my orders and I'm really looking forward to trying them. This is a hair serum that you can apply 2-3 to two, three times in a week just like you apply hair oil and you can just wash off after 20 minutes.
after this uh, mini unboxing i had to meet a friend for coffee and the temperature touching nearly 50 degrees in oman i decided to wear this pure handloom linen sari that is so lightweight and just perfect for the summers this is all for this video i'll see you next week